Pierre Curie and Marie Curie were both the Nobel laureates over a hundred years ago. They worked together in different scientific researches. They were an unprecedented couple. In this year 2018, another 12 have been awarded the Nobel Prizes for achievements that have conferred the greatest benefit to humankind. Their work and discoveries range from cancer therapy and laser physics to developing proteins that can solve humankind's chemical problems. The work also included combating war crimes as well as integrating innovation and climate with economic growth. Pierre Curie was born in Paris on the 15th of May 1859. He studied his early education at home. Later, he entered the Faculty of Sciences at the Sorbonne. He gained his licentiateship in physics in 1878 and continued as a demonstrator in the physics laboratory until 1882. Then he was placed in charge of all practical work in the physics and industrial chemistry schools. In 1895 he obtained his Doctor of Science degree and was appointed Professor of Physics. He was promoted to Professor in the Faculty of Sciences in 1900. He became titular professor in 1904. His father was a general medical practitioner. In his early studies on crystallography, together with his brother Jacques, Curie discovered piezoelectric effects. Later, he advanced theories of symmetry with regard to certain physical phenomena and turned his attention to magnetism. He showed that the magnetic properties of a given substance change at a certain temperature. This temperature is now known as the Curie point. To assist in his experiments he constructed several delicate pieces of apparatus such as balances, electrometers and piezoelectric crystals. He married Marie Curie in 1895. They made radioactive substances together. It was full of hardship especially because of little laboratory facilities. They had to earn their livelihood by teaching. They announced the discovery of radium and polonium by fractionation of pitch blend in 1898 and later they did much to elucidate the properties of radium and its transformation products. Their work in this era formed the basis for much of the subsequent research in nuclear physics and chemistry. Together they were awarded half of the Nobel Prize for Physics in 1903 on account of their study into the spontaneous radiation discovered by Bickel, who was awarded the other half of the prize. Pierre Curie's work is recorded in numerous publications. Curie was awarded the Davy Medal of the Royal Society of London in 1903, jointly with his wife, and in 1905 he was elected to the Academy of Sciences. His wife was formerly Marie Sklodowska, daughter of a secondary school teacher at Warsaw, Poland. One daughter, Irene, married Frederick Juliet and they were joint recipients of the Nobel Prize for Chemistry in 1935. The younger daughter, Eve, married the American diplomat H.R. Leibis. They have both taken lively interest in social problems and as director of the United Nations Children's Fund he received on its behalf the Nobel Peace Prize in Oslo in 1965. She is the author of a famous biography of her mother, Madame Curie, translated into several languages. Pierre was killed in a street accident in Paris on 19 April 1906. Source, Les Prix Nobel. Thanks for watching.